Now this is the story of Holy Joe. Holy Joe was a tremendous man of faith and was placed in the barracks among many unbelievers who couldn't care less about his gospel and his Lord. So one evening at bedtime brings us right up to date with Holy Joe. Knock it off! Let's go! Lights out! What the? I'm seeing things. Get the Sarge, quick! What is it, Sarge? Well, well, well. What do we have here? It's a holy joke. Man, I've never seen a religious nut like this before. I know how to crack this jerk. And now it's as good a time as any other. Hey, Holy Joe, here's your showers of blessing. <laughs> <laughs> Next morning. Hey, Sarge. We're going to have trouble with Holy Joe. Look what he did to the shoes we threw at him. He shined them. Put that little sicko on KP for one week. He's just begging for trouble. Miss Hall, four days later. How's Holy Joe taking it? He's driving me nuts. The more cruddy details I give him, the harder he works. He's like nobody I've ever seen. There's room at the cross for you. Look at him preaching again. I'm taking him to the head shrinker. Maybe we can nail him on a section eight. So far, nothing has stopped him. I think your Jesus in the Bible is a lot of trash. What do you think about that? The Bible says, for the preaching of the cross is to them that perish foolishness. Man, what he says really bugs me. He sound like my mother. She's a Christian too. Holy Joe spends some time with the head shrinker. When I gave my life to Christ, he forgave my sins, and I found peace of mind in someone who cared for me and who takes all of my troubles. But look at you, sir, miserable, lost, without hope, full of frustrations and going to hell. That's enough, soldier. I'm the one who does the analyzer around here, not you. You can go now. Jesus said, Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. How about it, Captain? Are you going to put him in the booby hatch? No, Sergeant. It's a matter of sublimination. He's getting his satisfactions in this religious neurosis. He's harmless. Good grief. What if what that kid told me was true? Maneuvers. Are you telling me that my life is being taped? Just like that, Henderson. On the day of judgment, everything will be replayed, even your thoughts. But I say unto you that every idle word that men shall speak, they shall give an account thereof in the day of judgment. If that's the case, my goose is cooked. That's right, Henderson. The only thing that can wipe that tape clean is the blood of Jesus. That's why he died for you on the cross. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. We finished maneuver, Sarge, and Holy Joe hasn't budged an inch. Got any new ideas? Rumor has it that we'll be in combat about a month from now. And when we are, I've got plans for that stubborn little fool. Joe, I've been thinking over all this religious pitch you've been giving me. And I don't think God is going to dump me into hell. I'm as good as anyone else. I don't need Christ or any more of your preaching. I'm sorry to hear that you reject the Lord like that, Henderson. Hey, Holy Joe, now I've got something to say. Beat it, Henderson! Jesus saith unto him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. Listen, you little fanatic. You knock off this religious stuff right now, or you're a dead man. 
sorry, Sarge, but for me to live is Christ, to die is gain. Okay. You asked for it. Combat. Sergeant, I need a man for a very dangerous mission. Do you have a volunteer? This is going to be a rough one. I have just the man, Captain. Holy Joe. Sending him out there is murder, Sarge. He isn't trained to- Shut up, Henderson. He wants to see the pearly gates. I'm just giving him a little shove. I'm still praying for you, Sarge. The following day. Sarge! It's Holy Joe! They got him! Look at his face. He looks peaceful. Maybe what he had was real. I couldn't care less. Let's get out of here. God, you know I'm a rotten sinner. I need this savior that Holy Joe spoke of. Oh, God, save me for Christ's sake. Sarge, we're surrounded. Run for it. Neither is there salvation in any other, for there is none other name under heaven given among men, whereby we must be saved. not at this, for the hour is coming, in the which all that are in the grave shall hear his voice. It's time for your judgment. Come with me. Wait a minute. I lived a real good life. I never hurt anyone. Why should I be judged? And as it is appointed unto men, once to die, but after this, the judgment. This can't be happening to me. Once dead, always dead. I've always believed that. Corporal Henderson stands before his creator. Review his life. Yes, Lord. His entire life is played back from birth to death. Remember saying that to Holy Joe? Oh my God, now it's too late. I'm lost, without hope. I don't need Christ or any more of your preaching. I'm sorry to hear you reject the Lord like that, Henderson. Does his name appear in the book of life? His name does not appear, Lord. And whosoever was not found written in the book of life was cast into the lake of fire. The Lord is not slack concerning his promise, but as some man counts slackness, but is long-suffering to us were not willing that any should perish, but that all should come to repentance. God's grace is revealed to the sergeant. God, you know I'm a rotten sinner. I need this savior that Holy Joe spoke of. God, save me for Christ's sake. That act of faith puts your name in the book of life. For by grace are ye saved through faith, and not of yourselves. It is a gift of God, not of works, lest any man should boast. The sergeant hears these words. Enter thou into the joy of the Lord. But as it is written, I hath not seen, nor ear heard, neither have entered into the heart of man the things which God hath prepared for them that love him. The Bible says there's only one way to heaven. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. Nobody else can save you. Trust Jesus today, that if thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus, and shalt believe in thine heart, that God hath raised him from the dead, thou shalt be saved. Admit you are a sinner. Be willing to turn from sin and repent. Believe that Jesus Christ died for you, was buried, and rose from the dead. Through prayer, invite Jesus into your life to become your personal Savior. What to pray? Here's what to pray. Dear God, I am a sinner and need forgiveness. I believe that Jesus Christ shed his precious blood and died for my sin. I am willing to turn from sin. I now invite Christ to come into my heart and life as my personal Savior. If you trusted Jesus as your Savior, you have just begun a wonderful new life with him. Now, read your Bible every day to get to know Jesus Christ better. Talk to God in prayer every day. 
be baptized, worship, fellowship, and serve with other Christians in a church where Christ is preached and the Bible is the final authority. And fourth, tell others about Jesus Christ.